Weather 12 forecast. Good morning. Time is now about 618. It's a chilly start. Temperatures in the 30s all across the area, and we're only going to get to around 50 degrees for the afternoon, so it's not going to be as warm as what we've been seeing, uh, but certainly not too bad out there on this Saturday. Let's take a look outside first. This is looking out at the capital city of Providence from our East Providence camera, and you can see here a nice little glow in the sky there with the birds flying and a pinkish uh, purplish glow uh, as the sun rises. Temperatures in the 30s, like I mentioned, 33 in Providence, 34 down in Newport, 32 out in New Bedford, and 31 up in Smithfield. So again, it's a cold start. These temperatures will rise, though, as we go through the day. Winds aren't too much of a factor, but they're enough to make it feel a little bit colder out there this morning. 26 is what it feels like in Smithfield. It feels like 28 in Providence. So again, the winds, here they are, all about 5, 10 miles per hour. Really not much of a factor across the area, but like we saw in those feels like temperatures, just enough to make it feel a little bit more colder. Three key things, cool and dry weekend, both today and tomorrow. Feeling like summer in my seven-day forecast. We'll talk about that in just a second. And also, I don't see much in the way of any rainfall in that seven day period as well. So pretty nice weather coming forward for us here in southern New England. A wide view satellite and radar high pressure in place. This is going to keep us dry, pushing those clouds to the south. And if we widen the view here, you can actually see a storm system off to the south along the southeast and Gulf Coast states. Lots of moisture here, but look at the way this is moving through the Carolinas and eventually offshore. So that frontal system and low pressure system will eventually move uh, to the south and stay to the south from southern New England. So again, we're going to be staying dry and quiet, uh, not only for today, but also for our Easter Sunday. Let's time things out for you again. Temperatures rising into the 40s, near 50 this afternoon. Sun, some clouds around, certainly not that bad. We'll see that all the way through the evening hours. Temperatures again tonight will fall back into the 30s and eventually back into the 20s once again uh, for tonight into tomorrow morning. So here's 6 o'clock Sunday morning. Again, below freezing for the most part. Some areas may even dip down again into the upper 20s uh, very early on Sunday morning before we rise those temperatures right back up into the 50s for Sunday afternoon. So today's forecast, a quick little recap. 50 degrees, cooler and bright winds north west around 5 to 10 miles per hour. For those of us heading to the Izzy Foundation 5K, first ever at Goddard Memorial State Park, you can see temperatures. It's a cool one. Temperatures getting to around 45 degrees at noon time. For tonight's forecast, again, those temperatures, upper 20s, lower 30s will do it. Clear and cold, those winds around 5 miles per hour out of the south before becoming light and variable, variable overnight. Here's that seven-day forecast. Again, we are featuring some summer-like temperatures by the end of the seven-day. Easter Sunday, though, looking pretty good, mid-50s. Our temperatures slowly rise throughout the week. 62 on Monday, 70 on Tuesday, 71 Wednesday, and you can see that 78, Joe. Summer feel will be in the air uh, looking like later next week for Thursday and Friday. Of course, get the full forecast on our website at WPRI.com and I have a feeling, Joe, a lot of people are going to be enjoying uh, those 70s that will be here by, mid by the middle part of the week. Yeah, and uh, a lot of people may be taking time off, so expect some sick calls on those days. <laughs> yeah, it's a nice stretch of weather coming up for sure. I know, and you got to be able to enjoy it. Hey, couldn't ask for a better forecast. Thank you very much. <laughs> Beautiful.